Hi guys, now I'm going to talk about the spectral analysis function in the Vortex system. Um, it's quite a uh, useful function to have, especially when you're trying to fault find um, the source of vibration in, in your test article. Um, sometimes you might find issues with bearings, um, sometimes you can find issues with um, stored blades on the on a fan or possibly um, uh, loose connections and things like that so just to get started um, what I'll do is I'll just pan over to the right and just talk about the spectral analysis in the oscilloscope software so in this um, particular software uh, I click on the frequency analysis and what that does is it samples the frequency range from the lowest being roughly 10 Hertz up to the highest um, in, this, in this case uh, the vortex can go up to about 1500 uh, Hertz what the vortex does is it samples the frequencies within that range and it actually gives you the locations or the frequencies which give you the highest readings those high readings respond to or refer to um, sources of vibration um, it could be an imbalance it could be um, bearing noise or other loose connections etc so what I'll do is I'll spool up the um, ductive fan unit and then show you what the oscilloscope um, uh, graph displays Okay, so <clears throat> I stopped the ductive fan unit and froze the um, the display on the graph. Um, as you can see, <clears throat> excuse me, um, the torsion peak in the graph actually responds to um, the RPM of the ductive fan unit, and that's given by the highest uh, decibel reading or highest peak in the graph. Um, in this case, it was um, around 68 hertz, which was the RPM I was running at. Um, the next highest peak here occurs roughly seven times um, that frequency of all the RPM. And what that actually refers to is um, what they call blade pass frequency. Um, so, to explain what that means, my inductive fan unit has seven blades um, and each blade passing one point um, gives rise to a frequency which is seven times the RPM and that's what we're seeing here. Typically if you're seeing um, peaks higher than the RPM or extremely high um, that could indicate that your blade is approaching stall or is having some kind of aerodynamic um, uh, disturbance of some kind. Um, there are other smaller peaks, uh, they could be referring to maybe uh, loose connections um, or some other vibrations in the system. So that concludes um, a very brief uh, summary of the spectral analysis in the Vortex system. Um, it's quite handy, uh, there's a lot of uh, data on the internet you could search for to actually understand what each of these frequencies refers to. Um, so search our website and, and have a look um, and, and you'll find it to be very useful. Thank you.